Well, that's Stuart here you are, son. This is your, welcome to the Peatling Channel, son. I've, I should have been doing this, should have done this years ago. Yeah. Anyway, there's no time like the present, and uh, it's good to see you back in business. You're at, at a last year with a very bad hip, hip injury, wasn't it? Yeah. Yeah, a bit ordinary. But How did you do that? Uh, just the pre-season training. Just, um, Was it? Yeah, change of direction and a bit of wear and tear from all the years of footy and yeah, she went back. But now you're back, you're right now, aren't you? I'm good as gold, mate. Now, going back, I reckon I was first started following Chelsea in 99 and I reckon you were, was you playing then in the, in the 15s? I would have been in the juniors, yeah, maybe 15s or 16s. Well, I reckon, what, under 13s or something? Uh, 15s? 15s, yeah, I would have been under 15s about then, I reckon. Because then I reckon you were captain when I started in 90, when I started watching, sort of take, it was 99 I first came and followed Chelsea. Yeah, maybe, I might have been. What, was your number five? Or was that Joel Connolly? No, nah, I was number six back then, followed in the old man's footsteps. And, number, yeah, six. number six. <laughs> <laughs> well, you were a bit of a star back in them, and you, I think you didn't you re represent the, uh, the uh, juniors in the co whole competition? Yeah, I played in the league for a few years. What they call that then? In the league? Was it in, in the league? league? Yeah, yeah, in the league, and um, played a bit of stingrays as well, but I wasn't quite good enough to. Oh, you had a go race, yeah, did you? it wasn't quite good enough to make them sides though. But uh, so taught me a lot. Well, did you have a few training runs there, did you? I, I, I made the development squad in under 17s, but I um, got cut for 18. So then I went back to Chelsea, was playing seniors there, so it's all good. Was there any any players there who sort of kicked on after you in that side? In the Stingrays? Yeah. Um, yeah, I played with Steve Solitech, he was in my year. Solitech, he he, what did he play yeah, with? He, he went to Port. I think he was the only one who got drafted from... from Salopec, he was a pretty good football, wasn't he? Yeah, he's pretty good, yeah, yeah. So that was the only yeah. one? Yeah, he was the only one, and Jay Adard was with me the year before, the year after, so he was a year younger than me, so he went the year after. Adard? Yeah, Jay. Want to see you? Yeah. When he's playing here? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So you were you're the same age as him? No, nah, he's a year younger than me, but in under 18, you played for two years, so he, he was the first year. Oh, yeah. Yeah. And so anyway, going back to this, this day and age there, you, you I, I sort of told you down the beach about three years ago that you should be captain, Stuart, and next and you was picked captain too. Yeah, yeah. yeah I, remember right, I, I remember I was down the beach, I said, listen, Stuart. <laughs> Looking a million dollars. <laughs> <laughs> well, you were, you were picked captain, and, and you're still captain, of course, you missed last year. Yeah. And I, I just sort of automatically just you continued on being captain, right? Yeah, yeah, it's been good. So. Well, you, boys. well, you're doing all right now. I mean, apart from, you, you have any problems with your hip at all or not? This year, no. No, this year's been real good. So I've done a lot of rehab and physio and all that sort of stuff. So, no, it's, it's um, it's come good. It's come well, good. I mean, you, you're still you're back in you're back in business, aren't you? You're in the in the you've got your got your mojo going. Yeah, I've been going all right the last few weeks, but I just oh no, you're going all right. <laughs> Now how's your, how's your hip going to ask you about that? You're, uh, and so what about Chelsea now, uh, Stuart? Look, I reckon five weeks ago we were not too flash. Uh, yeah, no, we're, we're, we're now. getting there. Yeah, we're getting there. We're all, we're all starting to, to buy into the game plan and do the hard stuff. I think it was a um, getting a core group together and staying together and sort of just believing that we could get get there was, was the key. Well, I so, th yeah. yeah, the last month's been good. We've, we've been working hard. So. Well, I think we can only go... Uh, tell me, is Smout playing today? I don't know. I don't know. I hope so. <laughs> well, he, he's a gun, mate. Yeah, he is good. He's good. And, um, you know, both are, are good when we get them, you know. So. Well, he keeps worth three or four goals every week, and he, he's, he's a very classy player. Yeah. Now, what else I was going to ask you about? Now, who was a, some, who was a, some of the really great players you played with Chelsea? Steve Cummings, he was a gun. Superstar, yeah. Uh, played with Peter Casales, Taylor Orish. Mr. Lewis. Uh, Mr. Lewis, he's a great mate of mine and he's, he's probably one of the best. Um, yeah, he's just about the best player yep, I've seen. Yep, yep. Uh, yeah, I've played with a lot. A lot of, lot of good players at Chelsea over the, what, 13 years I've been a senior. Well, now how long do you think you've got left in you? Two or three years? 
Oh, I reckon. More, wouldn't you? Yeah, maybe three. Let's see. Well, you know, I thought you were a lot younger, but you're 28. 29. Oh, 29. 29, yeah. 29 years old. But uh, no, I feel good. I feel I feel as good as I have ever. So I'll just um, I'll just take it week by week, year by year. And well, you're a fitness yeah, fanatic, aren't you? You look yeah, after your body. I do like to look after myself. <laughs> if you don't look after yourself, Stewie, you no one else will, will they? No, that's right, mate. That's right. Now, what else? I had a few things written. I've got a few, few things written down here. Because like, you come back after the operation, all right? Oh, yeah. some, who, some of, give me some of the players, good players you've played against. Ah, good players I've played against. I remember back to um, when Rye was in the comp, um, I, I had to line up on Michael Gale one day and ex Richmond. He, yeah, ex Richmond. He taught me a few few things. Um, he was a good footballer, mate. The best player I've actually played on is probably Berkey from Karingal. Michael Burke, um, He's I, still playing. Yeah, he's still playing. I just have to go to him every game, and he gave me a touch up every time I went near him. So he's a gun. He's still he's captain coach now. Yeah, yeah, he is. Yeah, he's he's, he's probably the best player I've played on. So. so what else? It should be one of two other fellas you've played against has been pretty good, haven't they? Oh, yeah, I can't. This is, yeah. Who else? Uh, there's been a few. Oh, that went. Kraska was good. Kraska Michael Kraska. Yeah, he's a gun. But he was full. But he's a full forward. You play on him? Oh no, I'm not on him. But I was down the back line, so I had to. He took a few speckies on me and all that sort of. He stuff, was a so. very unattractive man, but he is a very good. He take a good mark on him. No. Yeah, you really were. No kidding, Stewie. He was he ugly. Was very yeah. unattractive. No, he wasn't good. I don't no. think you like water either. Nah, no, nah. No. Because he had the big beard, didn't he? Yeah, no. Nah, he, he's a good player though. But he, he could take all these big marks and he was skinny as a rake, wasn't he? Yeah, no, he's, he's strong for his uh, size, so, no, he's a good player. Now, what do you think for the next few weeks, Stu? We've got, we got a rough chance of getting in this fight for the end of the year, the big big F word. Uh, yeah, we do. Like, we, we'll have to win today first, and then... Um, this will be a good test, wouldn't it? Yeah, and then we go in the next week against DD, and um, that's probably another big one we could we could snag. And, you know, we're just taking it week by week, and... Um, we need a few things to go our way, but look, we're playing the best footy we have for the last four years right now. So we've got all, we've got all the bit of, got our act together now, haven't we? Yeah, we have, and um, look, we we win the day, and anything can happen, you know. Well, I reckon we can beat this one so. because, uh, well, they, they beat uh, Man Eliza last week, didn't they? Yeah, they did. So they're coming off a good one, but look, today's a new day, so we'll see how we go. And what do you think of the coach? Ah, oh, he's good. He's good. He's got better. He um, it took a while to settle in, didn't he? But now, yeah, he's, yeah. He's, no, he he took a while to to get set in. It's his first year coaching, so but no, he's coming on well, and hope he sticks around, and I hope we have some success with him. But he coached Deer Park, didn't he? No, he didn't. He just played. Oh, he's a player. Yeah, yeah. So oh, this is his first go. Yeah, for, yeah, first coaching gig. So oh well, he's only new. I thought he, I thought he was captain coach. Yeah, no, nah, no, nah, he just played there last year, so... Well, you but no, nah, he's, he's, he's come along good. Well, he's had a, a very ordinary day last week, Lazy 7. It's a Lazy 7, yeah. He's yeah. One of the best, he was one of the best kicks in the AFL when he was playing, wasn't he? Yeah, he was. Well, look, he's where he's come from and what he's done, you know, he's, he's no slouch, so... How do you go with him, all right? Yeah, we're real good mates, actually. Well, yeah. he's, he's a bit like you. He's pretty tough, and you're tough. And uh, <laughs> well, t the tough fellas seem to stick together, don't they? I'm not quite as tough as him, but <laughs> <laughs> uh, there's not too many men tougher than you, Stu. I can tell you now. Front to a brick wall. As I, as I told you, my man, years ago, I said if he gets taken off, he would have been hit by a train. <laughs> <laughs> he ended up getting giggled there. Yeah. <laughs> but you're all man. He's a good mate, man. Yeah. So what else? What else is uh, coming up? Who, who's after EDS? Uh, we've got YC after that. Well, that'll be just, well, we'll, we'll give him a fight. Yeah, it's at home, so we'll see how we go. But, no, nah, it's just a week at a time for us, Baza, and uh, we'll see how we go. Well, anyway, sure, it's been never too late to an interview, but I've been, I should have got should have had you interviewed years ago. I've, been, now, I've been waiting 10 years for this, Baz. Been well, 10 that's years. right. Now the day's finally come. Now you're on the Peckling <laughs> Tube now, and where we go. On the Barry Peckling Footy Show. <laughs> <laughs> it's up there in the accolades when I retire, this will be up there. I'll, well, I'll, I'll you, mention this. The YouTube stays forever, then that's how they tell me. That's well, right, my yeah. mate Colin, he, he's, you've probably heard him yeah, talk. Colt. He's got the voice of a... Angel. Oh, he, he's, got, he's got the voice. <laughs> the voice. <laughs> but anyway, it's been, it's been a pleasure. It's never, it's never too late 
never too uh, it's never too late to do something and now I've got around to doing it yep thanks again Ryan Stewart and no worries, uh, all the best for the day and all the best for the rest of the season thank you thanks for having me cheers mate well done thanks buddy